It's been real, y'all. Yo. Yo, this is your boy Todd in, you know. <laughs> C coming at you from, you well, know. Anyways, yeah. I got this bigger guys today, and I haven't been making a video in a while. But uh, here is Deep Sea Miku. Who are you supposed to be? Uh, I was trying to do Baldwin, but I'm not, uh, I'm not a good oh, does, he, does he really sound like that? He, he does. Hi everyone, Kevin back here with another video, and I am joined with Psycho Fanboy, also known as Lance. And today's video, we will be doing my loot haul. So, it's a joint loot haul. Joint yeah. loot haul. So, um, I haven't done a, done a loot haul in a while. My May was actually delayed. So, pretty much my May and my June, most of my June figures were delayed to July and August. So, what was left of June and May pretty much combined, and I had that shipped couple weeks ago and I had this loot haul for a while and I was actually saving it to do a video with Psycho Fanboy. Yeah. So Anime Expo was over the weekends and we had a great time, didn't we? Nah. Yeah, uh, you know, not a lot of things worked <laughs> out as planned, but other than that we had, a, we had a good time. So let's cut to the chase and I have a package from Ami Ami. Good Smile Company, and we will be showing Lance's package from Ami Ami, and he doesn't have the package from Good Smile Company. However, we are going to be showing our Anime Expo loot haul, which we did go to the Good Smile Company booth mm -hmm. and buy their products. Mm -hmm. So let's cut to the chase. Here is the Ami Ami box. It's a giant box, rectangular. This is probably their large size boxes. Biggest my dick. Yeah. It's, yeah. Um, he also has the same size too. So yep. let's uh, cover this. I already opened it, and I kind of took a peek at uh, some of the stuff I got to make sure everything was safe and secure. So as usual, here is Ami Ami standard. Thank you for shopping with this card. We'll set that aside. And here are some. Opening the lids. Here is the Ami Ami paper. Paper. Oh, paper. Oh. Come on. Just keep that there. Yeah, we'll just keep that there. Okay, so Ooh. that's a huge box. Let us start with. I will show you what he meant by that. But let's start off with what we, what I got, the little stuff as I like to cover. Uh, here is the Persona Q Shadow of the Labyrinth 3DS case. Uh, I don't own a 3DS right now, but I will be purchasing one in the near future for this game and to buy Fire Emblem again, as I was playing that off my friend's 3DS. Great games and highly recommend it. Looking forward to this. Along with that, AmiAmi Ami was adding a bonus to that, which was the Persona Q tote bag. So. Uh, is that Spider-Man? Uh, yeah, I, I believe so, oh, but nice. they're adding this. I hope this is all in focus, but for the time being, we'll have to make do with what we have. Moving on, any fans of Witchcraft Works? Well, I got the Witchcraft Works keychain. So this has all the bad witches, but I thought they were really funny and, you know, nice. It's just, I don't know what side they were on, so... This is made by Hobby Stock, and I ordered this from, of course, Ami Ami. Setting that aside, we have this uh, Madoka teacup, which I will be taking out. Well, wow, through the box right there. So here it is. We have nice. Homura, Madoka, and in the back we have this stupid thing that nobody likes. But this teacup, you know, drinking some hot tea, you know. Probably never gonna use it. Yeah, I'm probably gonna never use it. It's just for novelty reasons, so. Setting that back in the box. Moving on, we have a carabiner. And this is the Kiru da Kill. Kira Kiru. No, you say Kill da Kill. 
Okay, kill a kill. Um, Cospa carabiner of Nonon Jakuzure. So you put your keys, and or you can go rock climbing, which I don't suggest you use this for rock climbing. Even though who knows, it might be good. Setting that aside, let's cover some something that I've never really ordered. But again, these are for novelty reasons. I ordered a Madoka chocolate, which chocolate. Chocolate. So this one's green, and it is obviously um, what flavor is that? Matcha They're green tea. Matcha. matcha green tea. This one's matcha green tea. So guess what? I'm gonna do a review on these just for kicks and giggles. Maybe even with Lance. I don't know. Ooh, will I get to taste them? We'll see. We'll see. We'll think about it. And I actually got another one. They had Mami, which she is in her... Is that a yukata or a kimono? I don't know. They, they look the same, but... This one is orange, so it is a uh, orange flavor, which... Mm. It's like a Japanese orange, but I don't know what it was called. Orange. Not that one. It's like a <laughs> specialty orange they have, but... Here it is. So, there's all the chocolate, but wait, there's one more. One more chocolate, and of course I had to get my favorite, Homura. And they have the Haragi figure for pre-orders, which they had on display at Aniplex, at Anime, Anime Expo, so. They look very nice, and this is just chocolate. There's nothing uh, special about it. So Homura's plain. She's Homura's plain. She's nothing special. What are they trying to imply with this? She's not special. She's No, shut up, she is yeah. special. So I think that's pretty much it for the minor yeah. stuff. So let's move on to the juicy stuff. Figures. Figures. So while we are on the the boat for Madoka, let's uh, add on to that. And I got an addition da, 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 to my Madoka GSE collection. And this is Sayaka Miki from uh, Good Smile, and she is the. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> Don't worry, it was just a box. It's all nice. This is the Good Smile Company, the movie, the movie edition. So there's the regular TV edition and the movie one. Personally, I think the box for the TV edition, it matches with the other ones, but the movie edition I think looks nicer. Because yeah. the color, and she has her hairpin, golden hairpin thingy. So that's pretty much it. There's Sayaka. For some reason, I want to say mommy. That's not mommy, that's Sayaka. And that was uh, off pre owned, by the way, on Ami Ami for AB, so practically new. And here I have a figure that is really huge, and I have been looking for quite a long time, ever since I started figure collecting. And this is Musubi from Sekide, the 1 7 scale by Muvik. So. Muvik. Really? Mulvik. I don't know. How do you know that? Okay, well, uh, this... Yeah, big figure. Uh, I'm really excited. This is the anime version. They have the regular version. Is but it cast off? Yes, it is cast off. Ooh. Another cast off. Because oh, she does bye. have a huge rack. So, we'll get that out of the way. Oh man, here we go. And... I need a drum roll. Big one. So that could have those the the stuff I showed just earlier could have shipped easily in a smaller Ami Ami box. But the reason being is this one last scale figure that won't come out of okay. This was the reason why my box is huge. So here I have Tomo Asama, which could literally be a third person in our review yes. sitting there. <laughs> Because her box size is retardedly huge. Gigundus. Yeah. This yeah. box is huge. But otherwise, there's her figure. She looks really nice. And there's the bottom. And Jesus. So this figure comes with the B2 wall scroll. And Kotobukiya thought it would be smart to put the B2 wall scroll in the box. And they put her wall, her not a wall scroll, a poster. It's just literally like this. So if you actually look carefully, I don't think you guys can see it because of the glare, but it's in there. That's the reason partially why she's big, but then again, she's a huge figure. What scale is that? This is a one... 
eighth scale figure. What? Not a one seventh, one eighth. So. Damn. Pretty big figure. And that's pretty much my Ami Ami haul, but I did get some stuff. From GSC. From GSC and what if I do? I got some stuff from Rakuten in Japan actually, and I got this. Mud Love, Yui Takamura, and Meya Mitsurugi. A clear poster. And I got two of them, the same ones, so I could display them like this. So you get both best of both worlds, even though you really need one. It's just... But yeah, they're both really hot and probably one of my favorites from the Mud Love universe. And that's that. Moving on, I actually... A uh, subscriber sent me a... Okay, so Maeda KG Tessu dust mat. I didn't order the Maeda figure without with the dust mat. I ordered it without because I just didn't see any purpose paying like thirty, forty dollars additional. So a subscriber of mine said that he wouldn't mind sending his over and said he wanted to give it to me. And here it is. It Look is, at that. It's pretty hot. So yeah, I believe his name was Patrick Hal Basin. I can't remember, sorry, but... Patrick Starr from Spongebob? No, not Patrick Starr, but he's from Switzerland, or Sweden, I believe. So yeah, that was the desk mat for Maya Dekeji, and we will move on to the Good Smile Company. So Good Smile Company, they did a couple recent shipments, and a lot of people probably know I am a... Or actually, both of us are very good fans, really good fans of... The Monogatari series. So, Good Smile Company released, re-released a really popular Monogatari mm -hmm. series figure. So that is Shinobu, Oshino Shinobu, and this was the second variant again. Um, I, yeah, I mean, I just ordered, I ordered her. That's all I can say. However, I ordered a second one, so I could sell it for hire, which right now doesn't look like the best idea because a lot of American distributors will be receiving her in bulk, so I got two right now. I don't know, I might sell her soon. So that's that, and I believe there was something else. Is there something else? I'm pretty sure there was. Is there anything else? I think that's about... It. Oh wait, actually, I grabbed something. I got something from Yahoo Auctions Japan, and this was from the recent release of the Persona 3 movie. So here is the poster. I will be framing this actually soon. So there's the P3 movie, and that's pretty much it, actually. I mean, it looks really nice. It'll look very nice frame. So that's pretty much it for my loot haul. If you guys can, I'm gonna end it here. We don't need to show his loot haul, but I'm just kidding, we'll have to. So I will cut it here and we will switch places. So see you guys in a couple seconds.